Here I have a sample um, Google form with dates and I'll have usernames. So for instance I had a simple username and they would sign up and say they signed up for multiple dates. I'd hit submit and I have some samples here already. So these are all the fields that the different users signed up for and they're separated by commas. So now how do I filter by the dates of choice? What I would do is go to data, go to pivot table report. Um, first, I'll first make sure you have all of your data um, selected. Uh, so I've highlighted the dates of choice and the name and I'm going to pivot table report. And here the first thing I want is a row and I'm using names for the row. I don't need totals. Uh, I'm going to columns is the dates of choice. And I might leave the columns. So now the value. When I click add value, it's dates of choice. And instead of sum, sum summarize, I'm going to click on count A. And so now here you see I have the users names in column A, the different dates and the number, uh, the dates that they've all signed up for. Oh, excuse me. I'm going to uncheck totals because I don't need, I don't think I want the totals. So now I want to graph this. So if I highlight all of that and I go to the little graph in chart, um, it, it doesn't make any sense the way it's lined up like this. So I'm going to actually um, go to customize and I'm going to stack it. And I, what I also want to do is go back to start and I'm going to switch the rows and columns. So here, um, here I have on the, the May 30th and June 2nd, Bill, Ali, and Jane are all signed up for both of those dates. In June 3rd, Abby is signed up, and June 2nd and 3rd, Joe. How did Joe sign up for two? Let me, let me go back and look at the data. Well, I'm going to create that graph anyway. So I either title her or you could just use the, um, uh, the, the spreadsheet here. But let me go look at um, the spreadsheet itself, the form responses, and see what we had. Yeah, I had Bill for some reason signed up for both those dates. So, um, so that I think that's correct. So give that a try, and I hope it. Um, Bill, Bill, Abby, and Purple Joe. Yeah. So, I th I think that will work. And if you have any questions, just contact me, and I'll be happy to help you out.